All right, folks, welcome to the beginning of episode three of Game of Thrones. Um, I think I'm doing very bad at this. So, um, we're just going to keep it on it. I might go through a second time on this and just, like, keep playing each part until I get what I want. But, I mean, I think it's more true to the games to actually get in to it and just barrel forward. Previously on Game of Thrones. To ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will install a garrison of... Oh, that was 20 so long ago. ...within your walls. You have a man you trust? My son, Griff. I suppose the Crown could be persuaded to secure Ironwood from House Forrester. Lady Marjorie might not look favorably on such an alliance. And it would infuriate Cersei. I don't Although know what would be, be amusing for me might prove rather dangerous for you. And your house. Father. I'm going to kill you. Is that so? I'm glad I found you, my boy. It's been far too long. Who the fuck is he? My uncle. Roderick? Roderick, by the gods, it is you! Sir? Fetch the maester! Hurry! Fetch the maester! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let her go! Oh, yeah. Did you actually show me the decision I made? Please? Yeah. You! You kill me. And the Lost Legion won't stop until you and your friend are dead. So I don't know if it would have been beneficial to kill that guy, but... She's been gone a while. She'll come back. I mean, give it like a day. If they catch her, they'll kill her. They won't catch her. She's costing us time. It's just that we need to get to Marine. Every day we lose here is a day that Talia or Ryan could be hurt or, or, or worse. You must return home safely, Asher, and well, you, you have a history of putting your faith in women who may not deserve it. You shut your tongue. You know, if that marriage had gone off, none of this stuff would be happening. She's my friend, Uncle. She's been at my side for a long time. Was it them? The Lost Legion? Aye. Too many for us to take. I counted about two dozen, maybe more, as well as horses. About half a mile down the canyon, and coming fast. Had to run my ass off to avoid getting caught. <laughs> It's nearly empty. You two care if I finish it off? It might be a while before we find more water. Nah. Drink up. Thanks. Right. We need to get moving. The hotel is worth water. I have made this decision. By the old gods and the new. <sighs> the Lost Legion. We're a hundred miles from Yunkai. When are they going to give up? You really should have killed Tazal when you had the chance. Men like that don't forgive. You cut off his hand. Not the kind of thing a person forgets about another person. He was defenseless. I didn't see a need to shed more blood. And how's that working out for you at the moment? It's only a matter of time before they overtake us. Horses ah, fine, bugger right? a harpy. Don't mind if I do. Can we double back? Not without meeting dear old Tazal. Can we quick time up this? We're well and truly fucked this time, Asha. During severe winters, when the Skahazadan floods, it carves out great underground rivers in the sandstone. And? And when those waters recede, 
those rivers become caves. And those caves might hide us, if we can find them. I mean, we're trapped for the moment, but all I'm saying is we, we needn't die here. Just standing our ground. Let's spread out and look for cover. If he's right about this, I may actually stop him. Yep. Well, yep. Uh, 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 I am a dumb... It's not gonna happen. It's too unstable. Do you think we could dig our way through? Or try to scramble over? I don't know. Either will be slow and tricky. One wrong move and the whole thing could collapse on us. Yeah, I get it. It's a stupid idea. What are you stupid for? Are you a cave? Hello? Is anybody a cave? Any cave well, we can't stay here, waiting for your butchered friends to corner us. Agreed. The faster we make a plan, the better. What do you think? Could we climb out of here? Pretty steep, Asher. And we'd be totally exposed if your friends arrived before we reached the top. I mean, was this like just a cave that you found right here? I don't understand. What in seven hells did you two do to rile these bastards so badly anyway? Well, back when Asher and I first... Looks like we're not alone. No obvious wounds. Maybe he died of thirst. Listen. That's water. I hear water. From underground. There might be a cave nearby. Look at this. Gold. Fat lot of good it did him. Grab the gold. He's not gonna need that. Asher. The Lost Legion will be here at any moment. This is Essos. There's always time for gold. Oh, shit. No! Screw you, game! Ponte Freedom! Que Sirizzi! Shit! Come on! Go, go! They're behind us! Damn it! Asha! Find us another way out of here! Got it! Asher, you're the worst fighter. You search. What in seven hells is that smell? There's a light! Go! See if there's a way through! We'll hold them off! Oh, balls. Ballsy balls. Esther? Uh, I'll come! We've got a bigger problem. Ponte Osenas! Ponte Sir Osenas! Hey! Hey! 
to move. Now! Uh, Malcolm! Uh, can you walk? I, I, I'm fine. I've fought wars with worse than this. Hurry! The beast is coming around! Best of the dragon. And you know what? We got the gold. Yeah, so the game just showed me a map, but it didn't let me like control or look around it or anything, and it kept moving, so it's kind of useless. Listen up, you sorry lot. Gather round. We're handing out assignments today. See, I can't assume that I can make any difference from here. Got it. <laughs> we'll be men of the watch before nightfall. Right. Sorry. No hard feelings over that business with Finn, yeah? I appreciate you not ratting me out over the knife. He remembers. It's nice to know there's at least one brother I can trust. Just promise me you'll stop stealing things, Cutter. All right. I swear it. Never again. Well, no guarantees on potatoes or lamprey pie. Or for that matter. <laughs> Just messing with you, Garrett. I promise. I'll mend my thieving ways. Well, aren't you two sons of whores looking thick as thieves? Yes, Having a you. good laugh over nicking my knife, eh, Garrett? Men like you turn traitor for nothing. It's in your blood. Finn, stop being such a bloody fool. When a man takes my gear, it'll be my fist that'll rip their heart from their gullets. You'll always be an asshole, Garrett. You're just a fucking craven. Oh, would you let it go? I've had enough of your shit, Finn. Fuck off, Garrett. Finn, leave him alone. It wasn't Garrett's fault. If you're gonna hate someone, hate me. With pleasure. Now, it doesn't matter what the world once called you. Oh, After guys. today, you're all brothers. Could even be that the man standing next to you saves your life one day. <laughs> nope. Or maybe you'll save his. <laughs> nope. Let's I find out then, shall we? Stupid braggart. Casper to the builders. By the, uh... Finn to the rangers. Eric to the stewards. Hugh to the rangers. Cotter to the builders. Well, better get in the builders because we're humped if we're in the rangers. And finally, Garrett to the rangers. Oh, That's no. it. May all the gods preserve Finn's you. Finn's gonna murder us. Well, there we are. <laughs> I'll be patching up the wall, and you'll be defending it. Should you northern boys want your gods to give a blessing to this union? There's a weirwood tree beyond the wall. Oh, sweet. Now form up and follow my lead. Okay. Making our way out to the tree for the, uh, pray to the old lords or the old gods. Oh no, a ranger Garrett, already. it's good to hear you'll be a ranger. Thank you. I know you wanted this. I'm ready to say my vows. I haven't said my vows already? I didn't have many friends when I first arrived at Castle Black. Grin and Pip, they'd as soon have seen me bloodied in the yard than offer a hand. It's because they're always brooding. I'd die for either of them. Our brothers. 
are all we have. We're brothers now. Like it or not, we're brothers now. Means we're gonna have to get along. Don't care about it. You wouldn't even be here if you didn't have snow leading you by the hand the whole way. I'd keep an eye out for you if you weren't such an ass about everything. You don't give a shit about me. Two of the answers would involve his arse. That's not true. You know how many rangers I've never heard from again in these parts. Some of that's become one myself. All alone out here. Wildlands everywhere. All wolves. Then don't worry. You were born to kill wildlings. That jab you gave me the other day, it fucking hurt. I suppose you were right. You want a different assignment? Because I hear they need someone to clean the shit out. <laughs> <laughs> So fucking mad at you guys. You're the closest thing I have to a friend. Oh. <laughs> We're friends now. That was an easy thing to patch up. <laughs> the wall's easy. Let's just stay at the wall. I'm good at the wall. So do like the builders not have to take the vows? I don't understand this. I thought everybody yet in the Night's Watch. Oh, look at those guys. Look at this. Hello, tree face. Oh, this is just the night's washed. Oh, can I catch up? Pledge my light and honor to the night's watch for this night and all the nights to come. Not too far behind. You knelt as boys. Rise now as men of the night's watch. Oh, that's lovely, Frostfinger. Go 
Don't forget the practice shots. Oh. Interesting. It's good to see you. They told me you were at the Weirwood tree. Wasn't sure you'd be back in time. What brings you here? A business with a night watch. A delivery of ironwood shields. Keep you all out of harm's way. Nice. That settles it then? Right, the delivery looks in order. Hi. That's good. Uncle? Things aren't going well at Iron Man's guy. I know. I heard the news about Ethan. I was standing not five feet from him when Ramsey struck him. It's a nightmare that plagues my dreams. But House Forrester is nothing if not resilient. Our house has survived for centuries. Let me help, Uncle. I can't just sit here at the wall while our enemies are circling Iron Man. That's why I'm really here. Do you recall Lord Forrester's last words to you? Yes. Before he died. Yes. His final command, spoken to you in confidence. It was a secret he only wanted you to hear. He told you the North Grove must never be lost. Shh. Do you know we both you? know what it is. Don't say it aloud. Is it north of the wall? And you think it's north of the wall? His notes suggest as much. And you must find it, Gannett. The search won't be easy. But you're a tuttle. Our lord knew you wouldn't fail him. Somewhere north of the wall. That's not a lot to go on, Uncle. How am I supposed to find it? The first chance you get to head north, take it. And then? Keep your eyes open. Leave the night's watch behind. Strike out on your own. This is no small request I make. I know that. But there's no other choice. I agree, Uncle. But how? A brave answer, Garrett. This will help guide you. I found it hidden in Lord Forrester's strong box. A page from our Lord's journal. But when he tore out and kept separate, why? I don't know. It's a map to the North Grove. Right. He said it was a citadel of some kind. Could this be it? No. No, it couldn't be that easy. It's hidden here somewhere. This looks familiar. What is it, Garrett? Alia gave me this. Before I left. Oh. And I just broke the band. Telling us where to look on the map. I don't really get this. Yeah, no, that. Well, that doesn't look right. Maybe try another.
Yeah, that looks good. Sorry, right, my friends are calling practically dad. Are we actually going to go piss off the wall? Like the, the game just gives you no room for like, like working through it. Like you throw one thing out, and then they respond, and you're just like, "I'm gonna stay the course." There are so many guests already arriving. Have you seen the wedding decorations they put up in the garden? So beautiful. Hmm. She is. Marjorie was but a lady when we are sent to serve at High Garden. In just a few days' time, we will be attending to a queen at a royal feast. Whoa. Where we stand, we will be able to see everyone. And everyone will be able to see us. We've certainly come a long way, haven't we? I've been meaning to say what I told you about my family. It means a lot to be able share that with someone. Someone I can trust. If handmaidens don't help each other in King's Landing, nobody will. Mm. Thank you, Mira. And you know I'll always help you too. Hold on, look. There he is. Lord Morgrim? No, next to him. Lord Tal. I don't want to be a handmaid. And this wedding will be the best chance of meeting a husband I've ever had. I have to go talk to him. Marjorie won't notice for a few minutes longer. Could you make an excuse for me? Please. Yeah. Go on then. It'll be fine. The wedding's still days away. Thank you, Mira. I knew I could count on you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I shouldn't be here, but we have to talk. I didn't know you would see an accident. Look, that night, I don't know what might have happened if you hadn't helped me. I'd say the same to you, Lady Mira. Look, I came here to warn you. Well, 
world, is it? If we're gonna survive this... What if they find his knife? They threw it away, and there was blood on it. Oh, oh no! You do not want to get caught looking for it. Just don't get in any more trouble. And I'll... I'll watch your back. We're in this together now. You saved my life. I don't even know her name. It's... It's Tom. Thank you, Tom. Don't thank me yet, Lady Mira. There's still a knife out there covered with a dead man's blood. And I don't... Mira! My lady. Really? A tryst in the bushes with that coal boy. Not to say it's wrong. All the laws of knights and things landing. You just don't want to spoil your chances of a good marriage. Can we just keep it between us? I've got better things to do. Of course. That's what friends do. I feel like we earned that, maybe. Marjorie expects us I guess she's probably going to say that either way. You can tell me all about this Lord Tarwick, in a way. Well, first of all, his name's Gary. And he has this really funny accent. He told me the cleverest story about the <laughs> Fascinating. Musicians, a list of songs to play for 